to welcome in the head coach of the Mustangs, Coach Paul Cantabene. Coach, uh, I guess let's start. I don't think it's good news, but what can you tell us about Joe Cannon? Uh, okay. We don't know yet. we got to get an x-ray or an MRI, uh, hopefully Monday. But, um, you know, uh, unfortunately, uh, he's probably not going to be uh, – Playing for a little bit here, uh, so we don't know. We don't want to speculate what it is, but um, so you know, another another defenseman down, and so you know we're down three starting defensemen. So, but uh, next guy up, and I thought our young guys we got in there played really well and did some good things, and we made some mistakes that probably hurt us. But uh, you know, we're playing tough, and our guys are really getting in there, and uh, we're giving ourselves a chance every night. We just you know we just we just got get we just got to find a way to get over that hump. We were talking during the course of the broadcast. It seemed like there were some self-inflicted wounds tonight that that really kind of bit bit you guys a bit. Yeah, a couple. You know, I think you know, you know, you know, we had a few, and uh, but there's by young guys. You know, so a couple of them are by seniors. You got to do a better job of, but some of them are by young guys that are learning, trying to make plays, and you know, you know, we, we give up a goal there. Tyler's got to see, you know, Russo's got to see JT wide open ahead, so we throw that ball. We don't give up a goal there, or or Louis doesn't reach around, and you know, and our box wasn't good early. He got kind of confused there, but I thought in the second half we gave her, we had opportunities. We had the shot that we needed um, their goalie 15 saves he played really really well and uh, really kind of saved them I thought we had I thought we had all the shots we would have wanted in this game and we just we have to start hitting those shots and I think that you know we just got to do a better job and the guys that got to put in those positions got to start making them and and uh, we got some young guys in there so um but we're trying and I think and I, I, I don't doubt our, our how hard we played I thought we played really really hard it's just that you know things aren't going our way we're a little snake bitten injuries or a ball bouncing here or a pipe there or you know you know <laughs> And we didn't get uh, very many uh, calls core away, actually. So, but it is what it is. Coach, quick turnaround game tomorrow night. Yeah. What can this team rally around to get ready for tomorrow night? Well, I just think we play hard. You know, I think we compete. You know, you don't see us getting blown out. We're not losing twenty to one or anything. You know, I think they play hard. You know, and and they want to win. You know, we're doing the right things. You just got younger guys, and you know, when you have the injuries that we do, and the in the people that are out, we do. It's you know, it's just basically take their whole starting defense that of, of Dickinson's whole starting defense and take them out and put their subs in, and we'll see how the game goes. You know, <laughs> so that's what it is. You know, that's what kind of what we're dealing with. But we got a lot of guys stepping up and playing, and we just got to get after it. You know, with some of our little inflicted wounds these guys are and they're not doing them on purpose you know they're, they're working hard and we just gotta we gotta get over the hump these guys just gotta believe that they're they're better than they think they are and they can make the plays there we're just we're just a hair off for whatever reason it is right now we're just a hair off it's not that we're a bad team we're just you know it's the same thing like lynchburg you know lynchburg's not a bad team they're two and four they play the number one team in the country heck very tough you know and but we're all the same you know and in the end of the day when you're one or two goal when you're one or two goal games at the end of the day you look at the end of the season that kind of defines the season you know we're you know we're what four or five six Six goals differential over, you know, four pretty, pretty good teams, you know. So we're trying, you know, and, but we're getting better. I think we're playing better. So, but it's just that we gotta, gotta make some plays. Give me the positives for tonight before we let you go. Give me yeah, what you there's, there's plenty of positive. I think your defense played well. I think you know, but you know, we gotta stay out of the penalty box. I just thought we took some really bad penalties today, and some of them I don't uh, quite understand. But uh, uh, the positives that we're playing hard. You know, I thought we cleared the ball much better than night eighteen to twenty. We just had the you know just the two, and then both. I think both of those were man down clears. And uh, you know, we tried hard. You know, we got a lot of things to build on. We got a lot of young guys out there doing really well and and getting there. And we're we're gonna get there eventually. And it's a tremendous event. Still it is. I think the event was great. I think a lot three. Great Great games to end the day. Uh, a lot of excitement. And I think it's what it's all about, though. You know, guys are here. Everybody's watching the games. I think it's, a, it's an outstanding tournament. Really spotlight Division Three lacrosse and some of the great players that we have, and some of the great coaches and programs that are out there. And I think you know, there's a lot of positives. You watch us come here and watch this tournament throughout the course of the day or online or whatever way you watch it. There's a lot of really great positives, and I think you think you see the excitement in all the games. Everybody's excited, and uh, it's great. And it was a cold, windy day, and we had a ton of people here, so it was real positive. And and tomorrow's gonna be a nicer day, so hopefully we get some more people out here. But it's just great lacrosse and teams really compete and getting after each other. Coach, thanks for taking the time to come up and join us. We'll see you tomorrow night against York. Thank you very much. He is Coach Paul Cantabene joining us here on the All Access Post Game Show on the Mustang Sports Network.